Hi Mike's Car Raider Parts. I'm working on a Holly 2 barrel 2245 carburetor and I want to explain how the choke circuit works on this carburetor. Uh, this is the choke valve. Right here we have the fast idle cam which is plastic on this carburetor. And over here is the uh, choke lever. Now on this particular carburetor what we have is what we call a divorce choke and that means the choke is divorced from the carburetor. The thermostat, is, I don't have one in front of me right now, but the thermostat is mounted in the manifold on the engine and a rod comes up from the thermostat, hooks right into here and when it's cold, you know, sometimes uh, you have to open the throttle a little bit when it's cold to allow that choke to close, that thermostat is going to push the, the choke up close like so. Okay. Now, you have a choke brake here, or a uh, vacuum brake, which uh, when it's cold and you step on the gas, it's going to uh, slightly open that choke valve so it doesn't uh, choke out the carburetor. Also, as it's choked, you see we're on the high point of the uh, cam here. And when as it heats up and the choke closes, there it goes down. So at idle, this is the screw. Now you can see I got it screwed way out for some other adjustments I was doing. This is your idle screw. This is your fast idle screw. Okay. Set your idle first. And then uh, set your fast idle and the speed you set your fast idle is uh, set it when it's cold if you can otherwise just uh, put it up here on the cam like so and adjust the speed that way use the uh, recommended spec in your motors manual it's different for different vehicles okay so that's basically how the choke system works. Thank you for watching.